and at the far end of the track, three fights left to jump. Epsom Demott still leads and dictates from the front. The leader by a cup, uh, length and a half. Leverock Nass is second. Hitman Fred is third. Then comes the grey horse, Sporty Yankee. That's the one, two, three, four. As they swing back towards us with half a mile left to run. Yeah, they're racing speed now. Here they come back towards us. Still the big horse. Epsom Demox enjoyed himself out there in the lead. In second place is Leverock Lass. Then in third place, the grey, Sporty Yankee trying to get into it. And right there on the inside is Hitman Fred. These four are clear of Meldrum Way. So, three flights left to jump, less than half a mile to go, and uh, Danny McMenamin just uh, quickens it up a little bit on Epsom Day Mots. Here comes Sporty Yankee, and Fergus Gregory into second now. Then in third place under pressure, Leverock Lass, then getting reminders is Hitman Fred. They've got two flights left to jump. Epsom Demotz hasn't seen another horse in the race. Can he keep going? Two flights left to jump. Sporty Yankee doing his best in second, but the leader's over the second last, and he's a clear leader. A mistake by the second by a tired Sporty Yankee, and it's Epsom Demotz. He could be landing a big Campbell here. Ten lengths clear. Coming towards the last, and he's safely over. Epsom Demotz, 12 lengths clear of Sporty Yankee, and this is a nice winner for Danny McManaman. Trainer Philip Kirby, the seven horse Epsom Demotz is coming home. He was pricked in style to win it very well indeed. In second place, just coming towards the line now, is Sporty Yankee, and that is the one.